why to work with the people with intellectual disability because uh, yeah, I started uh, I, I studied uh, clinical psychology yes coming to children's clinic uh, these people came to me as a clients F families where the person with this the child with disability was born then came professor Matulai uh, uh, 85 years old a professional uh, who was retired and still wanted to work and uh, the, the director of the hospital told that uh, he must sit with Vera because he's a psycho she is a psychologist and it was uh, 10 years uh, beautiful work with a person uh, with a great experiences and uh, last 10 years from 60 to 85 was working with a people with intellectual disability and mental, mental health. So I, I've got uh, uh, excellent uh, information and uh, a, a lot of uh, experiences from this person. And he took me to the whole Europe and I saw how it's possible to do it. It was very, very, very good. And then, uh, then maybe uh, I had a chance with, uh, to cooperate with uh, parents' organization supported by, by uh, Lebensilfe Germany. It was also an organization of uh, parents who, who have uh, people with uh, learning disability and mental health problems, psychiatric. And uh, when you live or, or when you work and also live with these people, then you obtain uh, really a, a, a lot of uh, personal experiences and uh, uh, as I was speaking that starting with uh, in a with the ch children then then uh, educational system uh, was the second phase when we tried to to support that uh, or to persuade uh, state that every child must be educated and we were successful and then they were growing and then they <laughs> they need a job and i created agencies agency for supported employment but the real a real answer is that uh, they give me much more maybe oh no maybe sure they gave me much more than i give them and it's very very hard to say what it is so, so, so daily when I come to the, to, for instance, I, I told that we had a coffee shop where people with intellectual disability are working there as a waiters. And uh, w when I c come there for coffee or take some, some friends there, so they are still uh, with a smile. Uh, they recognize my, my uh, uh, feelings if I am okay or not, what happened to you, how do you know it, I see. <laughs> so so it's, a, it's a beautiful relationship now and uh, that's, that's something what you must to do it when you want to, when I want to live a beautiful life.